and welcome back to the channel. I'm Arlene and I am the Bean, obviously. This is a channel where we talk about the ABCs, baby. We talk about anything I feel like talking about, battle bots, and crafting. So if you care about that, uh, you can subscribe to see more of me. And I don't know, like the video if you like it at the end. Uh, what do the people say? I'm on bang. God help me. Today we're talking about battle bots. I want to give a special shout out. Special shout out to Sue Clark. She commented on my last video and asked me to make a bracket update video. Thank you for watching, Sue. Um, and thanks for leaving that comment. That was so nice. Anyways, girl, we so shut up. Shut up out there. Anyways, so yeah, I'm gonna give you an update on my bracket as well as fill out a new Sweet 16 bracket and we'll see how I do with that. Also, housekeeping, my eyes, I can feel that my eyes are really bloodshot. I can't really, I actually can't really see it on the camera, but I'm gonna zoom in so that you can see. Uh, why would I zoom in on that? You're not gonna do that, Arlene. My eyes are extremely bloodshot. I'm sorry <laughs> if it's distracting to some people. I am allergic to my cat and I love to pet him and then touch my face and my eyes are just always kind of red. Also, I got makeup in my eye, so that made it worse. Okay, let's get into it. Gotta get my paper bracket out where I made notes. <laughs> I'm just gonna go over it really quick. I was right about Endgame versus Scorpios and Scorpios winning. And game one, I was right about Minotaur versus Bloodsport and Minotaur won. I told y'all not to sleep on Minotaur. Lucky versus Cop uh, Copperhead versus Lucky, I was right about again. I'm just like so smart. So Glitch actually could not fight because of some technical stuff that I don't know about because I'm not an engineer. I'm not a maths girl, okay? If you came in here for analysis, I'm here for mess. I'm here for mess and I'm here for fun. So Glitch did not even make it to the fight. Mammoth had to step in. Uh, they did not stand a chance though, I'm so sorry. <laughs> they did not stand a chance and Witch Doctor won. Next, Sawblaze versus Hijinx. Hijinx, again, did not stand a chance. Now, I was wrong about this. I was wrong about Hypershock versus P1. I picked Hypershock and I should have gone with my gut because P1 won. That was insane. <laughs> I did not see that coming, honestly. P1 was the victor. I should make this red, right? Shatter. Lost. Oof, to Riptide. That was kind of tough to watch, to be honest. I really didn't think Riptide stood a chance. But here I am, updating that. I was wrong about two of the fights. And I'm not counting the mammoth, uh, this keeps falling, doesn't it? Okay, do not fall again, micro microphone, please. I was gonna say microwave. So I was wrong about two of the fights on, um, on the March 17th episode. Over to the right, I was wrong about Ribot. I was really hurt by this. I really wanted Ribot to make it way further in the competition, but uh, I really didn't think 
Hydra was going to pull through. I honestly didn't. Hydra was down bad this uh, season so far. I was like, well, what are they going to magically <laughs> just start working? And uh, wouldn't you know it, <laughs> they magically started working. So Hydra is, um, they're going to be fighting against not Mad Catter. I was wrong about both of these. They are going to be fighting Black Dragon. So crazy. You never know what's going to happen. I love um, this sport for that. But I was only wrong about those two. The rest, I was right about. I was only wrong about those two. I'm so proud of myself. Am I? Girl, I'm good at this. I've been watching for a long time, okay? <laughs> My boyfriend's bracket on the right side, absolute shambles. <laughs> the poor thing. He predicted the winner last year. This year, it's not looking good for him. It's not looking good for him. Let's switch over to the Sweet 16 new bracket. Endgame versus Minotaur. So I originally said Endgame and I'm going to stick with that. I'm going to stick with that because while I love Minotaur, Endgame has been putting on an insane uh, season. I don't know. I don't... <laughs> I really want Minotaur to win, but I kind of feel like They're not gonna win against Endgame. Okay, Copperhead versus Witch Doctor. This is kind of tough. Witch Doctor looks really good. I originally said Copperhead and I'm going to stick with that. I think that Copperhead is just so durable. They hit hard and they keep on hitting. The driving's really, really aggressive. I will say though that it kind of is anyone's game. Like I would not be surprised if Witch Doctor won, but I think that it'll be Copperhead. Okay, Sawblaze versus P1. I originally had Sawblaze versus Hypershock, um, but I still think that Sawblaze is gonna win. I don't see how P1 is going to win against Sawblaze. That being said, I think P1 might be able to get under Sawblaze. That is if they can catch Sawblaze, although P1 is super, super fast. I think Jameson is the better driver out of the two, and Sawblaze is so aggressive. Um, yeah. I, I just think it's going to be Sawblaze. I will be extremely surprised <laughs> if P1 <laughs> beats Sawblaze. I will be extremely surprised. Um, you know, you, you can never say never in the great sport that is uh, BattleBots. But um, I really don't see it for P1 on this one. Okay, next, Uppercut versus Riptide. Um, I originally said Uppercut versus Shatter, but uh, Uppercut versus Riptide, yeah, I don't see it. Uppercut um, is the better bot, in my opinion. Blood Dragon, Blood Dragon, Black Dragon versus Hydra. <sighs> This one is tough, okay? It's tough now because apparently Hydra works now. <laughs> so I don't know what to... I originally... Well, this whole fight actually... I said Ribot versus... Yeah, okay, I said Ribot versus Mad Catter. So I this is like a completely new um, fight I have to think through here. I kind of feel like it might be Hydra. And I hate to say it, and you hate to see it, but I think it's going to be Hydra. I think now the game has changed, baby. And Hydra is in it to win it. Black Dragon is 
an amazing bot. Uh, I just think Hydra's gonna get under them. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Because I, I can see it in my head. Hydra getting under Black Dragon and flipping them a couple times, but because Black Dragon is so durable, they like get flipped, they come around and just, you know, wail on Hydra, and Hydra is not that durable. Maybe I should change it. You know what? For the sake of chaos, or whatever, not even chaos, but I'm gonna go black. I'm ch I'm changing it, and I'm saying black dragon. Okay, and I'm not talking about it anymore. I'm saying black dragon. <laughs> Flip versus jackpot. I had this matchup originally, and I said jackpot would come out on top, and I can I change my answer? <laughs> Can I change my answer? I think it's gonna be blip. I'm sorry that I'm changing my answer, but I think that blip is, first of all, the surprise of the season. Second of all, I've been saying that blip is an amazing bot this entire season and blip is one of my favorite bots this season. I think that Blip's uh, performance against Valkyrie was so dominant. They're flipping, uh, I think that their flipping speed is incredible. The actual bot speed is incredible as well. I think that they are going to get under Jackpot and flip the absolute poop at a jackpot and um i don't know that jackpot's gonna be able to take it however that being said i do see a world where jackpot does win um jackpot is a great bot a, a great budget bot or whatever um and they beat tombstone although Tombstone wasn't really like working that well this season but you know they did beat tombstone which I said, and my boyfriend tried to clown me because I picked Jackpot over Tombstone and look who's laughing now, it's me. Anyways, okay, what I wanted to say before was, can I, can I change my answer again? Because the way that I would foam at the mouth for a Hydra v Blip fight, I'm gonna change my answer, I'm sorry. I'm gonna change my answer because that is the mess and the chaos that I want to see. I want to see Hydra and Blip duke it out for best flipper of the 2021 season. So I'm changing my answer. I'm sorry about it, but I'm also not sorry about it because you and I both know that would be an amazing fight. Whiplash, vo ver Whiplash versus Cobalt. Now this is the matchup that I did pick, and I'ma still say Whiplash. Whiplash is taking the nut. Next, Rotator versus Tantrum. I said Rotator. I think I'm gonna stick with that. I'm going to stick with that answer. Rotator is having a great season. I mean, they are the number six seed this year. Yeah, I think Rotator um, is just, way more durable than tantrum in my opinion you came here for my opinion that's my opinion they have the gumption and the durability and the driving and the knockout potential to beat tantrum and face whiplash and lose that's right i still have i yeah whiplash is gonna win that fight. I guess we're going the opposite way. <laughs> All right. Oh my God. I should have gone the other way because now I have to think about Hydra versus Blip. <sighs> okay. Who do I think would win? Like 
Hydra versus Blip. I feel like if I were the BattleBots, uh, you know, powers that be, I would do everything in my power to make Hydra and Blip happen. <laughs> Point blank and the period. That's what I would do. And, you know, is that cheating? Yes. So who is going to win? I have no idea. I have no idea who would win. I think the better bot here is Hydra. And that is, you know, with the understanding that Hydra is back to 100%, you know, for the rest of the, of the postseason. Oh, God, I don't know. I don't know. We've only seen like one or two good fights with Hydra this season. But I think that Hydra has the better flips between the two. Blip can, tr Blip, one thing about Blip Blip is going to turn out the flips. You know what I'm saying? Blip is going to... Blip is going to flip you, okay? However, not all flips are created equal, equal. And I think that Hydra has the better flips between the two. And so for that reason... Also, Hydra is like lower... Blip is more like aerodynamic, but Hydra has that long like lip um, to get under Blip. I'm confusing myself with all these it words, but um, <laughs> I think that Hydra has a better chance because they can more easily get under Blip and they have better flips. Okay, that's all I had to say. Oh my God. Sawblaze versus Uppercut, it's gonna be Sawblaze. It's gonna be Sawblaze. Uppercut has really devastating hits, but I think that Sawblaze is the better bot. So I think it's gonna be Sawblaze. And then Endgame versus Copperhead. Copperhead is a good bot. I think it's gonna be Endgame though. Endgame has not lost. Endgame barely even sweat this season, I feel like. <laughs> So, I don't know. Hydra versus Whiplash. I still think it's Whiplash. I still think it's gonna be Whiplash. Hydra versus Whiplash. I think it's going to be Whiplash. I, I still feel that Whiplash is going to uh, win the Giant Nut this year. And then Endgame versus Sawblaze. I still feel that Sawblaze can be Endgame. I still feel like that. I I really think that it's going to be, for the Giant Nut, it's going to be between Sawblaze and Whiplash. These two bots are incredible bots. They put on great shows. I, I mean, a driving match alone against Maddie Vasquez and Jameson Go, like I would pay money to see. They're I mean, th it would be such a good fight, I think, between Whiplash and Sawblaze. Amazing driving, they're both a very durable bots, both control bots. I would not be surprised <laughs> if Endgame beat Sawblaze and they knock out Sawblaze again. Um, again, Endgame has not lost or even like sweat a little bit this season. <laughs> so, you know, it might be kind of silly to not pick um, Endgame in this scenario uh, to at least get to the championship, uh, let alone win the nut. But I think their luck, so to speak, will run out against Sawblaze, and Sawblaze is gonna beat them. So that is my updated bracket. Y'all, I'm so excited for this episode. It's going to be very wild. Uh, I'm sure a lot of uh, surprises are coming our way again. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. I hope you guys uh enjoyed the episode whenever you watch it is that all i say at the like this video if you liked it that would mean a lot to me i guess that's it i feel like i feel like i'm forgetting to say something but i 
think I'm just rambling at this point. All right, like it, subscribe, whatever. Bye.